Glory to the Empire, my friends. Ben Oni is here bringing you another clan event. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, before we get stuck in, I would like you to look at the link below. It's the 13th Tagma's point of view, which is the people against us in this battle. It's quite cinematic, so it's pretty cool. Uh, but anyway, so we've got five rounds. I am late to the first round. Um, I am playing for the Batonians, the clan I'm in, Team A. Team B it consists of the Legion of Serbia, the Company of Orsh, and the 13th Tagma. Three great clans. So anyway, marching to battle, my friends. Round one was we won, but again, I didn't witness that one. Um, and then round two, here we go. So we have got some cavalry on the hill on the far right hand side, but our main forces go to meet with their infantry between the archers. Very aware of the, the cavalry on the hill. I uh, came late, so I haven't got the gold to be a sergeant, but I have got the pike out. And we engage with them. Here we go. The fight is beginning. The shield on shields. What's that? The cavalry are coming in. I get a nasty hit. 83 damage on me. Not good. Uh, we're getting quite most of the kills. It looks like our cavalry is getting some kills as well uh, in, the, in the kill feed. The infantry are shield on shield. Not a lot happening there in, uh, just yet. But wait, some of them have just broken through on our right flank. The, M the Empire have pushed through. I believe this is members of the BRE on the other team. Um, they are giving us a good fight. I've still got walking mode on. I, I don't realise that for a second. The fight is getting a bit scattered. I should really be in the formation still. I shouldn't be out here. Uh, but yeah, ultimately we do win. I get taken down. and it, They do fight on for a while, but I didn't spectate it, I'm afraid. Sorry about that, my friends. But do we do win that round. Anyway, round three. They have got the advantage of the high ground. We have got a, an arduous task to climb this hill. Uh, I had some audio problems um, and I was sorting them out so I didn't get in on time to join this round but no problem, here we go. This is quite interesting, this is the first time I spectate uh, a fight like this. Tell me if you enjoy it, I would like to know if I should do more videos like this rather than playing. I, I enjoy just watching. Uh, anyway, so they've got the high ground, they're using that well, horses are flying around. Uh, some of our cavalry are coming in the rear, I'm sure their cavalry are running around as well. Their bowmen are getting some good shots off at the back of our line and anyone who's out of formation. The main infantry fight in the centre there, look. The, the Empire is holding their ground, it looks like we're hacking away at them. But we're not, we're not pushing them back at all, really. And again, there's some M Imperials who have broken through on, the, on, the, on our left flank. Moving them down the hill as you can see at the back there, taking out and harassing crossbowmen are like enemy cavalry harassing us and look our formation is completely shattering at the moment no line to be seen on either side to completely honest it does appear that the Vlandians are forming up at the back there again but the kill feed is predominantly in the Imperials favour let's skirmish a lot of one on ones going on the Vlandians trying to hold some sort of formation at the back there Imperials, they don't need to do much other than keep the high ground and make sure no one flanks round, which they're doing a great job at that. The numbers look pretty even, but I'd say there's a lot more Imperials left. The last stand of the Vlandians backs against the, the cliff. It looks like they know they can't take the hill, so just dying next to their brothers in arms is, is the fate they have chosen. Crossbowmen still alive, taking them pot shots at the at the cavalry. The Empire have reformed at the top of the hill, and they are making their way down now to surely finish off these final Valandians. We will see. Cavalry, there's a lot of enemy cav. There's no way, there's no way we can take them out. The last couple of kills, I can, I think we're seeing the Valandians falling, staining the sand red. Yep. Team B have certainly won this one. Well done to them. Side swap, round three. Here we go. So we take the high ground this time. And if you see there, they're running away. They they were also they were running to this high ground to try and get here before us. We made it to there because our spawn is closer. And then we push back over towards them where they've taken the high ground over here. We probably should stop stop engaging them in the high ground, but you know what? We we are not afraid of any fight. We will take the fight to the enemy. If we have to, and here we will have to. So here they are, they've got a great advantage there. I can't see their crossbowmen or their cavalry yet. I'm out of formation. 
couple of a couple of projectiles flying through the air. The crossbowmen are hiding behind that rock. And here come the enemy cav. One. Oh no, that's our cav, because of course we have sw swapped sides. The enemy cav is now the landing cav. Cheeky. This is the skirmish phase still. Waiting for the order to charge. It looks like we've been told to move up. Not all the way though, just a step. Quite quite nervous about the crossbowmen on the on the left hand side there. Oh what's it watch this bit? Badass. I look away, but yeah, cool. They jump over oh, about two of them jump over the front line and charge in. This is the Order of the Lake from the Bretonians there. They're some pretty badass players. They make some cool plays and here they are, they come in, charge down alone against three times their number, four times their number to break our lines. I go out of formation, which I should not do. Great cavalry charge there and some spearmen. They do get a few kills on them though. Um, the lines, the line is still holding. I'm out of position, but I'm in a good spot to get a cheeky kill from behind, which I do get. But ultimately, not being in formation is my death. Look, I should have gone after that kill. I should have gone straight back to our side. Instead, I, I, uh, I don't, and I die. Pay for it. Don't if you don't work together as a team, you die alone. Anyway, round four, my friends. This is great. So again, we have to take the fight to them. And again, the Order of the Lake, the BRE, they've came forward, look, away from the, the enemy formation. And they want to challenge us. Fiery is leading our infantry and he gives the order to charge. These badasses. They're not scared. Completely outnumbered. Chance of success, non-existent. But that doesn't, that doesn't phase them. Still going. Bring him down, Dangorn. Well done. That was cool. They should have charged in there, but no, they, they, uh, they, they've got discipline. That's what they have. They're holding the hill. They know they got the high ground there still, on the very edge of the map. Haven't, haven't had a fight at the edge of the map yet. You can walk out of the area. It gives you a timer, I believe. You'll see that a couple of times. They're pulling up. They're inviting us to the fight. Order for, order for charge has been given, I believe, on our side. Enemy cav coming through the rear. How effective will this be? Well, our, our cav come through the area. Oh, there you go. I get knocked over by an enemy cav. The fight has begun. Charge given. Engage. Cavalry everywhere. The two lines meet. People swinging their weapons. Team damage on. Careful, lads. I, I go forward to take some blows, but I get a lot of hits on me then. My shield is destroyed and I'm nearly dead. Not a good move by me. Get some damage on the fallen guy. He's still not dead. Try not to get myself killed. Find myself a red shield. Puh. Fight carries on. Even. Kill feed in the favour of the Vlandians, I'd argue. But leaning back towards the Imperials again. The fight carries on. Like there was a team kill there. Coming in through the side of the map, cheeky. I'm seeing red boys, it's time to fight. Not one step back, boys. Looks like we're doing good against them, but they are, they're giving us a good fight. Oh, no, no. Member of the Orsh took me down, but ultimately, team may win this round, guys. <laughs> Thank you for watching. There's many more to come. I've got another one I'm working on and I'm sure there'll be more future events. Good day. Glory to the Empire.